Imagine you woke up in the morning and you're getting ready to go to work, but the first thing you do is look at your phone and you've noticed that you have a new notification from Anime News. You read the message and it says, For the next Dragon Ball Super Saga will be focused on Oob, the new god of destruction. Bro, I would be so excited about this great news to finally see a character that has been long forgotten. Oob is a character that was reincarnated from Kid Buu in the Dragon Ball Z series. This character had grew a lot of interest in many fans because Goku seen a lot of potential in him when they sparred each other. So if Oob returns in Dragon Ball Super as a god of destruction, how would the anime fans like it? This theory is absolutely amazing because it broadens the scope of the story. So number one, stop bringing back Frieza. I repeat, stop bringing back Frieza and bring back characters that can help carry the story to new heights. I am very curious on the backstory of Boob's new life. Where has he been this whole time? And what did he do to reach the level of a god of destruction? There can be so many questions that you can ask that can help build the story. You can really branch on this whole story just off of Oob and have a new villain that can be his complementary opposite. The fans will love to see how destructive he can get at full power fighting different type of enemies that can stand before him. The writers can even create an emotional hatred connection that Oob has with Beerus and we could finally see Beerus fight at full strength displaying his true skills. Of course they wouldn't kill each other because they're two gods that are on the same team and have the same mission. But it would be cool to see. Oob is a type of character that you can do a lot of different things with because he doesn't really carry the main story. Goku and Vegeta does. So it's up to the writers to get creative on another level to attract more viewers to the Dragon Ball Z Super franchise. So I was thinking, why haven't they brought back Oob yet? Wouldn't that be a no-brainer to build a character that they foreshadowed many years ago? Of course it is, but the people over Dragon Ball Z are businessmen and they are focused on the numbers and not creativity. That's why they're playing it safe and constantly bringing back characters that they know will make them money. That's why Frieza keep returning in every series, from movies to the Tournament of Power and the new series Black Frieza. This is so annoying to the long-term fans and the short-term fans of Dragon Ball. The directors don't want to take a lot of risk that may cost them. Maybe that's how they're thinking or maybe not. But just imagine that Oob replaced Frieza in the Tournament of Power. That would have made way more sense than bringing back Frieza that just almost eliminated y'all from the movie Resurrection F. <laughs> that right there don't make no sense whatsoever. Whoever is writing these plots need to be tested for weed because they are high as heck. Somebody tell them stay off the weed. Stay off the weed. So let's vote for Oob as God of Destruction for the next Dragon Ball Super Saga.